This morning, I was accosted by three men carrying some poor soul's head atop a pike. Seems they mistook my uniform for a mark of nobility and demanded I shout, long live the Republic, to prove my allegiance. I suppose handing out tricolor cockades is now passé. What did you do? I shouted, long live the Republic. A man of principle. Life is more valuable than dignity. But this is what happens when you give command of the government to half-starved lunatics and command of the army to bloodthirsty savages. Rui. I wanted him assigned to some out-of-the-way garrison, but the man redefines the term friends in high places. He's untouchable. But you know where I can find him. Rumor about the barracks is that he and a unit of his cronies plan on marching on the Grand Châtelet this afternoon. If he were to meet with an accident, few in France would suffer. My career certainly wouldn't. Well, practice your speech making. Nobody try anything. Come on, boys! Find me a warden! Go to the guillotine for this. Keep it down, you bastard! I don't know what you need to do, but thank you. You can thank me by getting to the walls and stopping these killings. Get up, fucking hell. What a mess. What do we do with the bodies? Dead as a man. Uh, leave him. Why are you waiting? Talent on display. Hey, Arno. What's all the fuss about? 
one less overzealous in the world. Not dreaming. Hey, you there! Stop! <laughs> a bit of weight since last you saw him. If you have orders to remove us from this hall, you must also get authority to use force, for we shall yield to nothing but bayonets! Ministers to govern. To govern is to reign. That is the essence of the problem. Mr. Mirabeau. Pathetic, isn't it? Surely France deserves better. What was that? An indirect Roy, clean up your mess, it's tight. Told you I could make him talk. You've done well, Captain. Breathe. The price of grain is higher than ever, Grandmaster. Our agents are in place to divert the shipments to our docks. They await only your command. Good. Starve them. Through famine and fury, they will see their false masters for what they are, but do it gradually. What you're asking will take at least a year, Grandmaster. If not two. Oh! Ah! 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 Ah!
will make you pay! Je fais du temps, mais... J'espère qu'il n'est pas sujet au vertige. What do you know about grain merchants? Good to see you too. Most of them are very poor just now, why? I have a lead on Germain. He has a woman named Marie buying up grain shipments and diverting them to a private dock. Marie Levesque? You know her. The Levesques have been Templars since the Third Crusade. Marie was the only one who argued against Germain's exile. I'm not surprised she's thrown in with her. Any idea where we might find her? Not her, no. But what little grain makes it to Paris these days is unloaded at the Hôtel de Ville docks. Promising. I'll start there. Perhaps I can learn something of Madame Levesque's whereabouts. Chase the boat. Yeah. 
than a drunken milksop. Heave to! Tie off the bowling! Captain! Any problems? No, madame. You have your orders? Here, madame. Good. And I'm instructed to tell you to make certain one of the bags leaks. Uh... Yes, madame. Get to work! Sournois à mon goût. Seigneur, que s'est-il passé ici Oh diable Garde Garde À l'aide
Halle Luxembourg. Hmm. And what are you up to there? Marie-Lévesque had men unloading the barges and taking the grain to the Palais du Luxembourg. If the people think the royal family has been hoarding food in a time of famine... Bedlam. Just the sort of thing Germain seems to thrive on. Madame Lévesque is yours. I'll find the stolen grain and try to get it out of there before anyone finds it. Stay out of trouble. Don't get caught. Done yourself this time. Merci. Now pray, excuse me, I need to see to my husband. to ignore an artist in need. Almost there! Nearly done! Oh, beware! Here come more! Another run of the friends! Look out! Set it! wish I could reward you properly. No need. The distraction will be more than enough. What was that? Nothing. Oh, c'était que... Quelqu'un emmène ce cadavre. J'espère que tu as trop honte. I have one. 
anything you want. Just let me out. What did we do to deserve this? Just get me out of here. Let us out of here. You want money? I have money. Just let me out and it's yours. Let us out of here! Just get me out of here! Huh? That's odd. Yeah. I'm begging you. I have a family. Just get me out of here! <laughs>
nothing. Hold it, you! Stop there, citizen! Try to ditch me, corpse! Remember what I told you, Marie. Oui, Maman. Francois Thomas Germain, for your crimes against the Templar Order, you are cast out. Let any man offering succor to the exile share his fate. Boo. The man speaks to me. No, it's mine, De La Serre. De La Serre! Milady, you have a caller. I need your help, Marie. You were right. King Louis's been talking to all sorts he shouldn't have. Plotting against the revolution out of one side of his mouth, while he promises to support the Constitution out the other. Good. I trust you can get this information into the proper hands, Monsieur Le Peltier. Of course, Grand Master. With this evidence in hand, the King's conviction is certain. What? No time to explain! Run! Will we be taking a ride this evening, Professor? Uh, no, 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 no. I'm afraid not. These older models are entirely at the mercy of the breeze, and there is far too much of it, I'm afraid, to be safe. Now, this particular example... What do you think you're doing? Get out of there this instant! Cut the ropes! I'll cover you! Oh, my... <laughs> Can't have 
to you. Hang on. I'll try to stay put. It certainly is lovely up here. You should see the view. You don't say. The wind is picking up. You'd better hurry. Yes, thank you. Have you thought at all about how you plan to get down? Oh, these things tend to work themselves. to run out of roof soon. I hope you've got a plan. Does watch and laugh as you crash into the river count? There it is. be trying to hit me. What did you do back there? It's a long story. Your pardon, monsieur. Next time, I plan the escape route. It's beautiful. 
From up here, you'd never know the nation is tearing itself apart. Can... Can things ever go back to the way they were before, do you think? Do you? After everything that's happened. Everything we've lost. So that's it, then. The course of history forever altered, never again to return. Maybe we can't go back. But going forward isn't necessarily an ending. Please, I... You cheated. You took too long. I love you. I had to dash. You looked so peaceful, I didn't want to wake you. Je t'aime, Elise. Someone will come and collect it. Surely. <laughs> 